Hey guys, welcome to this tutorial on using progress indicators with Material UI. You can create different types of progress indicators by going to the Material UI progress indicators menu. Let's start with the simple ones. We have three types of pre-made indicators, circle flat, circle raised or linear. We can change the width of the linear progress indicator to whatever we want. We can also change the height but we recommend using the height of 4 as specified in the material design guidelines. By selecting each progress indicator, we can change its current progress using the slider in the inspector. We can also define, if we want, whether the indicator will start in an indeterminate state. Let's take a look with the two circles one. If you want to show the indicator at a certain time, we can make it start hidden by selecting the appropriate option. Next. We'll see how to create a progress indicator that already has a horizontal or vertical layout with a label. Let's create a flat horizontal circle progress indicator and a raised vertical progress indicator. Once they are created, we can of course specify the text we want. Finally, let's check out how to interact with the progress indicators with a script. We'll create four buttons, one that will show the progress indicators, one that will set the indicators to a random value, another one that will set the indicators to indeterminate state, and another one that will hide them. We'll start with all the progress indicators set to start hidden, so we can show them by clicking on the show button. We'll also untoggle the start indeterminate parameter. We just need to call the public methods to do what we want. Show, hide, set progress and start indeterminate. We could even set a random color along with the random progress. Well, that's it for progress indicators. Don't forget you can play with them in the example scene. See you soon for a new tutorial.